Rising tensions between two nuclear armed rivals, India and Pakistan, over the murder of 50 Indian soldiers in Indian occupied Kashmir are being fueled by Israeli weapons. Israeli made bombs, the Spice 2000 smart missiles, were used by India in its attack on Pakistan territory. They were sold to India by Israel as part of one of the largest weapons deals in the Zionist state's history. Israel is now India's main arms supplier, with deals worth around a billion dollars a year. The two nuclear-armed allies have conducted many military drills since the Zionist-friendly BJP government swept to power in 2014. Amongst the items sold by Israel to India are radar systems, ammunition, as well as air-to-ground missiles, which have been tried and tested on Palestinian civilians in the Gaza Strip. India claims its attack was in response to the Pulwana attack, but conveniently leaves out its brutal 72-year occupation of Kashmir, where almost 1 million heavily armed Indian soldiers terrorized the daily existence of Kashmiris. The Indian government has refused to accede to a UN-mandated plebiscite for Kashmir to determine its own future. Right-wing Zionism and right-wing Hindu nationalism of Modi's BDP are becoming terror brothers in arms. Both push the convenient narrative of Islamic terrorism to have a superior claim to the land that they currently occupy. The international community must pressurize India to accede to the plebiscite in Kashmir. They must begin by instituting an arms embargo on India to ensure no Israeli arms further fuel the conflict.